Hey guys, this is Nekha Verma. Welcome to my channel. So in today's tutorial, we will learn how to create disco ball light logo in Coral Row. So let's get started. So this is the size of our page, 10 by 10. Now we'll select the ellipse tool from the toolbar and we will draw a circle. Now we will set the size of the circle 3 by 3. Now we will make a copy of circle by drag and right click and we will reduce the size. Now we will place the small circle on the top of the big circle. Now we will select both and we will set the align. Now we will double click on the small circle and we will set the center point of the big circle. Now we will select the option transform and now we will set the angle 360 by 40 and we will write copies 39 because we have already one. So now you can see we have 40 small circles. Now we will set all and we will deselect the big circle. Now we will right click and we will select the option group. Select the small circles and we will fill the color and we will remove the outline. Now we will select the small circles and we will drag and right click to make copy. Now we will change the color. Again we will drag and right click make a copy and now we will change the color again we will do the same change the color In the inner side we will take a lighter shade of pink but in the outer side we will take a dark shade of pink. Now we'll select all and we will click on the option align and distribute and we will set the align horizontally and vertically. Now we will decrease the size. Now we will select the big circle and we will remove the circle. Now we will select all the small circles and we will right click and then click on the option group. Now we will keep this aside and now we will select the rectangle tool and we will draw a rectangle. Now we will set the size 10 by 10. Now we'll select the pick tool and we will select the rectangle and now we will give a black color to this rectangle. Now we will select the both and we will set the align now we will select the square and we will right click and then click on lock now we will select the small circle and then right click and click on undo all
now we will select the circles randomly and we will change the color We will select the text tool from the toolbar and we will select the font and now we will write the text. Now we will give a pink color to outline and we will remove the fill color. Now we will go to the text property and we will increase the size of outline. Now again we will go to the text tool and we will select the font and we will write the text. Again we will give a pink color to outline and we will remove the fill color. Now we will go to the text property and we will increase the size of hairline. So our logo is almost ready guys we can use this logo like this also but I will add the shine for that we will select the shape tool from the toolbar and we will select the shape star we will make a 4 point star so we will write the 4 in the points or sides now we will zoom and we will select the shape tool from the toolbar and we will drag the nodes like this I will decrease the size of the star. I will give a white color to this shape and we will remove the outline. Now we will go to the effects menu and we will select the option blur. Now we will select the Gaussian blur. Radius should be 15.2. Now we will click on OK. Now we will place this shine in all the white circles. So guys if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so you can get the updates of my new videos. We can increase or decrease the size of shine. So our disco ball light is ready guys I hope you like the design if you have any question regarding this video you can ask me on the comment box thanks for watching please like share and comments and don't forget to subscribe my channel